Hey everyone, it's Catherine with Catherine Rhodes Photography. So happy you're joining us this week for episode four. After last, last week's episode, I've had a few questions come in about why photographers don't give away all their digital images in a wedding package. And um, this week I kind of just want to touch on that, you know, um, kind of get into the background of, you know, why photographers value those digital images and why um, it's not just a digital image going onto a DVD and, you know, being sent off. Digital images actually have a lot that go into them, from the editing, to the equipment that they're taking on to the education that goes into you know just the photography being able the photographer being able to take them themselves um, so that digital image itself is a piece of art um, something that a photographer themselves really wants um, their clients to be able to enjoy as a piece of art and to be able to print one day or to blow up into a beautiful canvas in their living room. So um, that's really our main objective when we take those beautiful images for you is to really enjoy those throughout your home. So on top of that, um, normally a studio for an 11 by 14, something around those, can charge up to $100 for a print like that. And when we hand those digital images over, that studio loses out on that um, revenue for that image itself. So you do have to, we have to compensate a little bit for those digital images on top of, you know, the education, the equipment and everything that goes into taking those. So that's just a little background as to why digital images or the DVD itself is um, is a little bit higher priced than, you know, most people think that it's just easy to throw all the images onto a DVD and hand them over. Um, you know, quality, education, things like that do, um, do affect the pricing of digital images and um, it's just a good thing to remember when you're going in to book your photographer. So if you guys have any other questions about um, digital images and rights to images, things like that, printing rights, feel free to send those over at Catherine at CatherineRoadsPhotography.com or you can leave a little comment here on the blog. All right guys, I hope you stay tuned for next week, episode five, and until then I'll just look forward to chatting soon.